Assalamu alaikum my dear students and viewers of class 10th English. We will continue our yesterday class Long Walk to Freedom by Nelson Mandela. Yesterday I gave you the introduction about Mandela and the Long Walk to Freedom. This is the autobiography written by Mandela about the freedom struggle of South Africa. Dear students, you know as the India, as our India was ruled by the British people. Then the people of India, they, uh, they play a part in the freedom struggle. So likewise, this Mandela, he also played an important role in the freedom of South Africa. You will open your book on page number 30. I will read the text and you will keep a copy uh, and write the meaning of the words. 10th May dawn bright and clear. It was the 10th May. It was the 10th May. It was the 10th May morning. Ye das ye May ki ye May ki das tari thi jab azadi ka suraj tulu hua and the clear for the past few days I had been pleasantly besieged by the dignitaries and the world leaders who were coming to pay their respects before the inauguration. Who is I here? I is Mandela here. He says that, that on this very date, on this important day, on this red letter day, I was happily surrounded by the people, by the, by the famous dignitaries of the world who were coming to pay their respect before the inauguration. Before the inauguration, so on the inauguration means uh, when they were going to inaugurate the new government. The inauguration would be the largest gathering or of the international leaders on the South Africa soil. So, till then, there was no such gathering. But he says that this was the largest gathering on the South African soil when it got freedom. The ceremonies took place in the lovely sandstone epitheto formed by the union buildings in Pretoria. And where was this celebra uh, where was the celebration held? It celebrated. It was held in the lovely stone amphitheater. What is amphitheater? This amphitheater means a very big auditorium. Amphitheater. You will write down the word amphitheater. Amphitheater means a big auditorium. A big auditorium. In Pretoria. For decades, this has been the seat of wire supremacy. So, this, this, this amphitheater, this was the seat of wire supremacy. There was, the government was in the hands of white people. So, there was the white supremacy. Now, it has transferred to the black people. And now, it was the site of rainbow gathering of the different colors and the nations of the for the installation of the South Africa's first democratic non-racial government. Now, till then it was, it was in the hands of white people. Now, it is the site of uh, rainbow gathering. What is the rainbow gathering? You have seen the rainbow. There are different colors. There are seven colors. So, why he has... Why he has compared this gathering with the rainbow gathering, with the rainbow color? Because there were the different colors of the people all over the world. So there was no discrimination. It was the day when the, when the new government and the non-racial government was to be inaugurated. That was the South Africa's first democratic non-racial government where everybody was allowed. There was no white supremacy. On that lovely autumn day, I was accompanied by my daughter Zanani. On this autumn day, why the autumn is here? Because autumn is the season when the farmers are reaping, when they are reaping their crops. Ye uh, autumn ek aisa mosum hai, jab ek kisan apne ye jo isne kamai ki hoti hai, uska phal paata hai. To the uh, the South African, they fought the struggle of the freedom. So now they are getting the fruits of it. So it's depicted here on the autumn day. 
he he says that mandela kehta hai ki i was accompanied by my daughter what, what was the name of her of his daughter the name of his daughter was zinani on the pen, on the podium podium here means stage podium on the podium you know when there was a large gang so there was a uh, there was a stage was set mr clerk was the mr clerk was the first sworn as in as a second deputy president so mr clerk was he was sworn first sworn he was he pledged as as the second deputy president then thabo mbeki was sworn as the first deputy president when it was my turn now when it was the turn of nelson mandela i pledged to obey maine ye vaada kiya to obey and uphold the constitution and to devote myself to the well being of the republic and its people maine ye help liya ki main constitution ki ye jo ayin ye jo ayin hai south africa main iski hifazat karunga aur iska ehtiram karunga aur apne aap ko apne logon ke liye waqf karunga to assemble to the assembled guests oi watching and watching the watching world i said aur jo wahan audience the unse maine keh diya aur jo baaki duniya kya kaha maine now these are the actual words of nelson mandela today now he says today uh today all of us do by our presence here aaj hum apni wajah se yahan pe hain confer glory and hope to new born liberty ab jo humne ye nayi azadi hasil ki usi ko usi ke ehsaas mein out of the experience of an extraordinary human disaster that lasted too long kyunki insaniyat ne bahut si tabahi dekhi hai now after a long period we are celebrating this must be a must be born a society of which all humanity will be proud so hum ek aisa samaj ab samaj mein jee rahe hain ab jisme sabon ke hukuk barabar hongi aur aur har ek isme khush hoga har ek ko fakr hogi we who were outlaws do not uh, we who were outlaws kyunki aaj tak hum kya the we were outlaws outlaws mean rebellions we were rebels not so long ago kuch hi mudd pehle have today been the rare privilege to be the host of the nations of the world on our soil now aaj hum duniya ke logon ki mezbani karte hain apne is sarzameen par we thank all of our distinguished international guests for having come to take possession with the people of our country of what is after all a common victory for justice for peace for human dignity main mandela kehta hai kyunki main tamam ye jo duniya ke mumtaz shakhsiyat yahan aaye hain main inka shukriya ada karta hu aur wo hamare apne is hamare mulk mein hamare is sarzameen pe aaye hain kis liye hamari hamari is honor ke liye izzat ab hausla afzai ke liye after all this is not the victory of ours only bus but this is the common victory for for justice for peace and for human dignity and for human human dignity so i think this is enough for today because we cannot upload the big videos here thanks